adding rational expressions with common denominators, we're asked to subtract these two expressions. And we already have a common denominator of 2b, so we know that our answer, we can add those together and keep that denominator. So no changing to do here. But since we're subtracting and I've got this leading negative out here, it's important to realize that those negatives apply to everything behind them. So when I put this expression together under this common denominator, I'm going to go ahead and distribute that negative so that I'll be able to combine like terms. So distributing the first one here, minus 1 times b would give me a minus b. The minus times the positive 2y would give me a minus 2y. And then doing the same thing here, minus times 9b is a minus 9b. And then the minus times the minus 9y would give us a plus 9y. So by distributing those negatives, I now can just combine like terms in the numerator. So I'm going to keep that denominator of 2b. And then looking for like terms, I've got a minus 1b and a minus 9b. If I put those two together, they can combine to be a minus 10b. And then I would want to do the same thing with the y's. I've got a minus 2y and a plus 9y. So if I combine those together, that would be a plus 7y. So combining like terms after I've distributed those negatives out in front and keeping that common denominator, I end up with our solution, which has already been simplified as much as possible.